good evening children so the first story which i will be reading today with you all is hansel and gretel okay this hansel and gretel was written by the famous writer kate gladden so let's start reading the story a poor woodcutter lived in a forest with his family so what is a woodcutter one who cuts wood so there was a poor woodcutter who lived in a forest with his family he had two children named hansel and gretel so he had one son and one daughter their name was hansel and gretel so the next page the children worked hard but their stepmother was never happy so hansel and gretel had a stepmother who was very rude and she was never happy with the two children she was mean and gave them little food so this stepmother was so rude and mean that she gave them very little food to eat okay she was not at all good to hansel and gretel one day the stepmother said they had no food no more food she decided to send hansel and gretel away one day what did the stepmother said that she can't give any more food to hansel and gretel and she decided to send hansel and gretel somewhere far away okay she woke the children and told them to follow her that very night what she did she woke both the children and told them to follow their stepmother the woodcutter could not stop her he was very sad the woodcutter that is hansel and gretel's father knew it but he could not stop his wife he was very sad why he was sad to know that hansel and gretel would be sent to a far away place by their stepmother next page the stepmother led hansel and gretel deep into the forest there she gave each of them a piece of bread the stepmother then what happened led hansel and gretel very deep into the forest and there she gave them a piece of bread to eat see in the picture the stepmother is leaving hansel and gretel and moving away okay collect some firewood she said and then she left what she said to hansel and gretel that both of you collect some firewood and by saying this she left the children worked and waited but she did not return the children worked and waited for their mother but she did not return she did not came back it was dark in the forest hansel and gretel were frightened they tried to find their way home as the day passed by 
the forest become dark it was night and both the children got frightened they both of them tried to find their way back to their home but they could not they ate the bread and walked for hours they ate the bread that they had with them and started working they walked for hours finally cold and tired they slept under a tree so they walked many many miles and they become became tired it was cold outside and what did they do they slept under a tree the next day they started walking again what happened the very next day they again started walking they went deeper and deeper into the forest and they don't know their way how to go back home and when they started once they started working they went very deep into the forest they walked and walked and grew very tired after working for so many hours they were tired to their surprise they found a house made of candy what did they found a house made of candy both the children were hungry so they were very happy to see a house which is made of candies the children were very hungry gretel ate some cookies as they were hungry what did gretel do gretel took some cookies from the house and started eating hansel ate a piece of roof made of gingerbread hansel also took a piece of gingerbread from the roof of the candy house and both of them started eating suddenly someone cried out who is nibbling on my house then a witch came out and caught them when they were eating what happened a witch came out of the house so the candy house belongs to the witch when she saw that someone is nibbling on her house she came out and caught them caught hansel and gretel the witch locked hansel in a room she made gretel start a fire the wicked witch was going to eat them so what did the witch do the witch locked hansel in a room you can see hansel is locked in a room and she asked gretel to start a fire why did she asked gretel to start a fire because she want to eat them by cooking them she wanted to eat both of them the witch was in a hurry as she checked the oven she slipped and fell the witch was in a hurry she was very hungry she wanted to eat them and she was hurrying up so that she could eat them as fast as she could cook them and eat them so she checked the oven and she slipped and fell down she fell right into the hot oven then what happened she fell into the hot oven 
Just then, Hansel and Gretel's father and stepmother found them. By that time, what happened? Hansel and Gretel's stepmother and father were in the wood. The stepmother felt that she had done wrong to them and she was sorry for it. Their stepmother was sorry for what she had done. Now, she was very much sorry that she had done very wrong with them. She wanted to take them back home. Together they found the witch's treasure and went home. And what was there in the witch's house? There was treasure. So they got all the treasures of the witch and they went back home. Hansel and Gretel were never hungry again. And both the children lived happily with their parents. Their stepmother never kept them hungry anymore. And they lived happily ever after. So how was the story children? If you like the story, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more such stories. Okay? Bye-bye. Have a great day ahead.